The parents of a missing North Suburban man are offering a reward for information leading to his location. 24-year-old Thomas Howe has been missing since January 22nd. His parents and the Antioch Police Department are pleading for any help in finding him. CBS 2's Mugu Odigwe explains what we know right now. $10,000, that is how much Howe's parents are offering. They're hoping it's more than enough to help them with the crucial goal of finding their son. Here's how his dad described him this morning. He's the first person to drop everything he is doing to help someone else out. He's always there for others, whether it is sitting down at home to have a cup of coffee just to talk, to help make dinner when he's home, or just hanging around watching TV when he's home. So according to Antioch police, Thomas Howe was last seen around 11 in the morning on Saturday, January 22nd. He was involved in a crash near I-94 and Route 176 in Libertyville and left the scene before police arrived. Antioch police say since then, hundreds of volunteers and officers have taken part in coordinated searches. In fact, Howe's cell phone was found in the Old Forest Preserve in Medawat two days after his disappearance, but he's still missing. Tommy. If you see this, and if you are confused, please know and remember how deep our love and care is for you and the strong bond that our family has. Please call us if you can. If you can't, if you can't, you can't remember, you can't remember the number, please go any local authorities wherever you are. Police say he is five foot eight with brown eyes and brown hair. He was last seen traveling on foot wearing a gray North Face jacket and jeans. There have been lots of posts all over social media about Howe's disappearance. Even this Facebook page with more than 8,000 followers that's updated regularly with new information about the case. Now, Antioch police have a tip line for any leads on this case. That number is 224-788-4409. Again, that is 224-788-4409. In our Streetside studio, Mugul Dikwe, CBS 2 News.